A new holiday tradition coming next month, and it has something for everyone. 7 News' is Christine Scarpelli is live in Greenville and hopefully staying hey, dry friend. at Floor Field. Good morning. Yes. Certainly, yeah, we weren't taking any chances. We want you to be able to see the vendors, all the exciting things that will happen at this Kringle Holiday Village. We are not out in the rain. We are also hoping for good weather on December 9th, 10th and 11th. That's when the Kringle Holiday Village is, but getting your tickets today really beneficial guys. The prices go up tomorrow and donating blood at a blood drive right here where we are floor field today gets you buy one, get one free of those tickets. So why would you want to come? Well, Santa. And there's going to be some is it glue wine, I believe, some beverages, some German food as well. Here at different parts of Floor Field, it's going to be themed in different ways. We're going to show off vendors this morning because I love to shop. And Emily creates all kinds of cool things we have in front of us. South Carolina Chic. Mm -hmm. All right, tell me, are you going to be anywhere specific at the Kringle? So I will be outside. Um, I should be booth number 12 outside. There you go. Look for her booth number 12. What are some of the items you sell here? Do you so make these? I do. Look we, at this. Um, I do make them. I also do a lot of the design work. So we have customized t-shirts here. Okay. Um, these are some of the best sellers. Cereal Point Killer. <laughs> not, not a, a hugger, hugger. Yes. Of course, the Christmas teas, Merry and Bright, Fa La 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 La. Awesome. Um, we have earrings. These are wooden and acrylic earrings. Stocking we have, stuffers. Absolutely. Yeah. We have these cute little gift box sets that have little stud earrings in them, perfect for the younger girls or even anyone who likes to accessorize. Emily, you have a story behind a lot of this, right? Emily is also a teacher, yeah. so supporting her support. It's a teacher, a local business, and this all kind of started out in school, right? It did. I wanted to create some t-shirts, some school spirit t-shirts for my uh, co-workers and for other people at my school. And from there, people were just like, oh, you can make this. Can you make this design for me? Can you do this? Can you do that? And it just grew and grew. And so I really enjoyed it. So many other vendors here we have this morning have a lot of unique stories. I know that's really neat. Um, being able to see some of these items uh, from start to finish must be really neat too. If mm -hmm. our viewers are listening this morning and wondering whether or not they should buy a ticket, supporting a local vendor is important. Why? Oh, absolutely. Um, so, I mean, for a lot of us, this is the way that we make our living. Um, for some of us, it's not just part time. This is where this is what pays for yeah. everything that we do. Maybe even school supplies. Absolutely. You could Lots be helping kids everywhere. Yes, by buying a lightning struck uh, board over there. Check those out, guys. Some really, really neat items. All of this and so much more at Kringle, guys. 9th, 10th and 11th of December. WSPA.com is a great place to find more information and tickets. Send it back to you, Fred. Thank you, Christine. The time right now is 624.